Hi everyone, John Connolly, President of the Twin Cities North Chamber of Commerce, and this is Chamber Check-In, your source for virtual networking, great local solutions, and content. Hey, we're glad you joined us today on Chamber Check-In. A shout out to Nine North. They produce Chamber Check-In. We appreciate their partnership. And for all things Chamber related, event related, and resource related locally here for businesses, go to TwinCitiesNorth.org. That's TwinCitiesNorth.org. Org. And there you find all sorts of ways to connect with local businesses, like the person we have today on Chamber Check-In. Today we have John Letourneau. He manages our manufacturing cohort for the Twin Cities North Chamber, and he uh, manages a company called Market Forward. John, welcome to Chamber Check-In. Um, apologize if it's a little wonky on the coverage here, but we're going to do our best. It's thrilled. I'm thrilled to be here. Uh, really enjoying uh, the experience I'm having uh, working with the chamber and especially supporting manufacturing in the region. This has been um, an effort that's been ongoing now for a little over a year. And I just want to maybe give you an update quick that um, we're working on a grant that we won last year called the Drive for Five. And we submitted this grant through the state and it's given us an opportunity to do something that our manufacturers have been asking for for a long time. And that is to put together a video campaign that gives and informs our community, especially our workforce, uh, on the great jobs that are out there in manufacturing. And so we're in the process right now of delivering on this uh, grant and deploying it. And we're um, working with multiple members of our chamber in the manufacturing community, capturing some really cool footage and doing some great storytelling around um, the wonderful jobs and the amazing career opportunities that there are in, uh, for manufacturing. Yeah. We'll get these uh, videos put together and we're really looking forward to what that's gonna do is in regards to our ability to kind of market uh, and, and really uh, take advantage of some of the workforce opportunities that are out there. Right, and uh, you know, just to emphasize everyone, uh, October is Manufacturing Month here in Minnesota, and that's why we wanted to have John on to emphasize the opportunities in manufacturing. So, John, just on a macro level, tell us what manufacturing means for our area. I mean, what does it mean? <laughs> you know what it means? It means that you can get a really good job that's exciting and dynamic. You could start um, a family, buy a house, get a really cool truck, and do it without a hundred thousand dollars worth of debt, uh, education debt. Wow, I mean, good story for anyone uh, looking at a career in manufacturing. And you know, here's here's another question: uh, Why is it that uh, manufacturing is so important, not only to our local but to the state of Minnesota's economy? I mean, what what products are produced that are significant? Well, you know, it's, it is about the larger economic picture. And so the corridor that we live within here um, has a high concentration of manufacturing. And it, is, it literally covers so many different aspects of all of our lives. Everything you look at and everything you touch is probably been manufactured by somebody locally in this area. And some of the highest concentrations of manufacturing are in um, like aerospace and medical and we do a lot of metal forming and um, those kind of uh, um, manufacturing processes are really uh, very predominant here. And so they, they just encompass uh, thousands of different projects and thousands of different jobs. Right, and, and you know, here's the thing about manufacturing is that uh, a manufacturer might just make a small component that goes into the larger, you know, unit. Like uh, think of a car, all the thousands of parts, you know, there might be a half dozen manufacturers right in our area uh, that go into that. So it's super important. Plus it's uh, that export. Uh, it's that money, outside money coming in that drives economic development for our communities, right? Yeah, these are all really great components of um, how important the manufacturing industry is for our region. Um, it, it's all interwoven in, in the things that we all do and need and use every single day. And um, to know that that is actually happening right here, it's really quite remarkable. And um, it, it's amazing how if you were to drive down the highway, you don't even realize how many uh, different manufacturing organizations there are here. And they, they just play a huge impact on, on not only our local economy, but the world economy.
Yeah, I know. And uh, the Minnesota Chamber, everyone just uh, did a big poll and a big contest, the coolest thing manufactured in Minnesota. And the winner was, uh, get a load of this, Post-it Notes by 3M, right, John? You know, and <laughs> yeah. they said that was the coolest thing. But uh, that's just one of, you know, thousands and thousands of products here uh, manufactured in Minnesota. And there's a lot of cool things, whether it's beer or whether it's uh, Post-it Notes or whether it's uh, popsicles. It's just uh, kind of fun to talk about. Hey, um, in our area, you know, some of the things everyone are, uh, I mean, it's diversified. That's what I, I wanted to get at, John. There's a diversity. You mentioned metal manufacturing, but also you've got uh, Johnson Screens, which ma manufactures filters. You have uh, medical technology companies that manufacture things. Old Dutch makes potato chips right here in Roseville. So it just it crosses over so many boundaries and diversifies their economy, which uh, adds strength to our economy, right? 100%, that's what, that's what it's all about. It used to be able to use this word like trickle down uh, economics and it's all interwoven again in the fabric of this community. And so this, this effort that we have supporting manufacturing is, is just so important. It, it touches everybody's lives. And this is, uh, this is an important aspect of, of how we are doing our work. Uh, it's really important to feel and and be attached to something that makes a difference in the world, and that's what this does. This this really makes a difference. I agree. Uh, there's purpose behind all these products that are made here because you can see it; it's tangible, and you can see it, feel it, and touch it. Everyone. Hey, uh, John, we have about 30 seconds left in this segment to talk about Manufacturing Month in October. What? Tell us your last thoughts you'd like to share with everyone here. Last thoughts, again, it's just going to kind of echo some of the things that I've already said. It's just really important to know that so much of what we do every single day is interwoven in what's going on with manufacturing in this region. So I think, you know, as a community, we should be super thankful that these manufacturers are here. They're creating these great jobs. They're doing these things that are actually changing the world. And it's an honor uh, for me to be in this role, to be able to move this forward and, and to have, like, my aspect of it affect so many people's lives. So I'm, I'm super thrilled and, and I think that's really the chamber. Absolutely, yeah. John Letourneau of our Twin Cities North Chamber Manufacturing Corps, thanks so much for joining us on Chamber Checker. We appreciate your time and everyone uh, just, uh, you know, once again, a shout out to all our area manufacturers here the month of October. They produce so many quality products that keep our economy running on a local level. And now the vision of the Twin Cities North Chamber of Commerce is to promote business, develop leaders, and connect communities. And we're so glad you connected with us today. A shout out to the Nine North team that produces Chamber Check-In. We appreciate their partnership in producing Chamber Check-In. And remember, for all things chamber related, local source related, go to TwinCitiesNorth.org. That's TwinCitiesNorth.org. And you'll find all sorts of ways to connect with local businesses and attend local events. Everyone have a wonderful weekend.